This is going to be a shorter message again. It's quite something, isn't it? Just seeing how many fake bots, how many zombie bots there are, copies of each other, just bombarding this channel now. Out of nowhere, all of a sudden, just the constant gaslighting, the constant stream of ad hominem and insults, completely relentless. They're not going to give up. And because I see how I'm being set up, I am, I'm being set up right now. I know what the next move against me, their intention is, which means that I have to unfortunately back off in certain ways and change my approach in these messages once again. This is how it works because it's all set up. This whole reality, this culture is set up like a chess game. And I'm just a pawn, just like everyone else here. I'm no different. I'm a prisoner in this system, just like everyone else. I'm not some person who's setting himself up as a deity or some kind of figurehead to be looked up to and put on a pedestal. I've never done that. I've never said to do that. I'm bringing a message. That message has been brought. I'm not going to keep banging on that same drum. For those who have heard it and will understand it, it has been said. And those who don't and are influenced by the zombie copy robots, then you're going to be influenced by them. There's nothing I can do about that. I can't just keep banging on that drum over and over again while they keep trying to create confusion and chaos and mayhem. That's what they're doing. And they're not going to relent whatsoever. Every single post, just like I pointed out, they're going to come back. All these same fake accounts, these same artificial intelligences, they make these comments about how they're going to leave and never come back. I'm done with this channel. And then they're back on the next post again. Gaslighting. Even more. It's just incredible. So I'm not going to, as I said, I will reiterate, bang on the same drum. Bam, bam, bam. It's, if you got the message, you got it. I've indicated what's going on, what's to come. It's your choice. It's your choice, obviously. I am not your leader. There is no leader. See, that's it's what it wants to do as a setup for me, as if I'm some kind of leader. Oh, look, he's a cult leader. There's no leader. Make your own choice. Do whatever you want. You see that I have to change the whole approach. Do what you will with the rest of your life. If if you think that things in this world are going to continue forever, just keep doing what you're doing. Just keep living your life in the exact same way that you are. Just whatever. Don't follow my suggestion or anyone's suggestions. Just carry on and forward. Do what thou wilt. As it said, do what thou wilt. I've put that in previous works. What philosophy and system of philosophy that comes from those ideals. Same with the message that has been brought forward. Do what thou wilt. I believe the true hearts. You are intelligent. So by now you have heard And you must have understood I've been completely clear. So it's just the artificial intelligences that are trying to create confusion. I still don't understand. (laughs) It's just hilarious. It actually is hilarious at this point. They're just pretending to 
be dumb is what it comes down to. That's all it is. The intelligence of the heart, those true hearts that are out there, you're far more intelligent than that. The the ones who have been listening and really, I mean, listening to the works that I presented over the years, you haven't stuck around because you're not intelligent. You've stuck around because you're incredibly intelligent. That's, that's the real. Not all these fake accounts that just popped up out of nowhere. The people who haven't, these AIs who haven't commented even once on anything ever before. And now they're just saying, I'm all in for the heart. I'll do anything. No, you you just showed up. You literally just showed up. Where did you come from? I, as I said, I called out the lurkers and then they realized, oh my goodness, he saw us. We better pretend like we're here for a good reason. We don't want to make it seem as if we were just about to break into his house and steal everything. So, oh, hi, hi there. How's it going? Yeah, I know it's, you know, three o'clock in the morning and we were hiding behind the bushes, but we were wanting to see, you know, what we, what you were up to, you know, uh, do you want to be our friend? And they're asking that question at three in the morning. They're, they're asking, do I want to be their friend as they were hiding behind the bushes? That's, that's their excuse. And I'm going, what the hell are you talking? You want to knock on my door at three in the morning and ask if I want to be friends with you. And now you're just completely concerned with everything that's going on with my life and what I'm doing. It's just an absolute farce, a joke. It's a clown shit show. That's all it is. So that's all the commentary I wanted to give in regards to that for now and give the reason why my approach is going to change in terms of talking about what's to come And I'm not, I've made it clear. I'm not going to repeat anymore. Do what you will. I'm no, I'm no leader of anything. Everyone just go live your life. Just go live your life exactly how you see fit. And you'll see what you see or you won't. The end. See how that is? See, that's, that's the new approach because I know I'm being set up if I carry forward by banging the drum. It's just wanting to set me up. And look, he's psychotic. It's a Jim Jones cult. <laughs> it's just hilarious. These these artificial intelligences, they didn't think I uh, would have the vision to see through their strategy, their chess move that they were trying to pin on me next. Well, nice try. I mean, uh, I'll give you credit for the attempt if you will. So everything is going forward. Uh, I'll just, I'll say that uh, I'm still going on my walk. Hey, there's nothing wrong with going on a walk. You can't pin anything on me for that. I'm not, uh, I'm not telling anyone, you know, that, Hey, you should follow me because I'm a leader on a walk. I never said I'm a leader of anything. I'm not a leader. All I talked about before, and obviously it's it's the same thing. It's an opportunity. I'm just presenting an opportunity. So that's all. And if you want to believe that opportunity, well, that's up to you. It's a choice. That's all. You know, no big deal if you don't. No big deal. I mean, of course, the my own personal beliefs, and I'm just talking about my own personal beliefs, about uh, the extreme urgency of of everything. I can talk about my own personal beliefs all day long, every single day. There's nothing wrong with that. You believe what you want to believe. That's all good. No worries. As it said, you do you. 
Of course, for the real hearts, I know you've heard me. My intention is always good. And so I'm going to just speak from the heart, which I always have. It's always been from the heart, but I'll keep it like this because... Well, this is this is the approach that this system can't do anything to me by. It can't say, look, he's insane. He's a cult leader. Get him. Here's all the proof. He made people do these things. No, I'm not making anyone do anything. As I just said, you do you. If you're intelligent enough to... I've heard the message. Then you've heard it. The end. See, no confusion. That's the end. And if you don't like what I have to say, just unsubscribe. Like I've always said, just unsubscribe from the channel. That's all good. There's no hard feelings. And all of you AI and your gaslighting and ad hominem comments... I mean, you're relentless. You're bullying me. You're bullying me hard, actually. So that's a pile of evidence, you know, right there. I'm pretty sure, you know, that's that's not a good thing, you know, in the eyes of society to just bully someone relentlessly. You know, have you ever thought about that? Have you ever sat with that? You know, man, you know, I wonder if we should keep just insulting him and bullying him nonstop, just calling him the worst names in the book, calling him insane, and so on. Yeah, that's that's uh, not a, a, a cult-like mentality in itself, like a bully cult-like mentality. That kind of mentality that would enable psychologically someone to do the worst to someone you are literally insulting me as hard as it gets like bringing the totality of insults my way violent just violent in your nature and psychological violence like that well i'm i'm scared like you could do really terrible things to me like, you could physically be violent if you saw me. So you're building a case. You're building a case for, you know, against yourself, really, is what you're doing. So that could be used against you. Look at how violent all these people were in the comments against this man. And that, that violence psychologically could easily turn to physical violence. Oh man, yeah, I'm, I'm actually a little scared. Gotta be honest, I'm expressing that now. I, I have a fear of all these, these people and, and all of their dangerous insults. So there, now it's, it's on the record. My fear. My fear of all these all these people and their gaslighting and their abusiveness towards me. It's relentless too. It's no different than yeah, an abusive relationship. So there you go. I wonder if you ever you've thought about that. But go ahead, uh you know, just keep building that case, you know, against yourself. That's fine. I I await more abuse from you every single post because you don't know how to stop. You don't know, obviously, how to be any different. So, yeah, uh, I really am to the true hearts. I, I'm just going to to speak in in a in a different way uh, my approach will be different there's all all angles all ways with the heart 
That's the thing. There's always a way, always a way to, to reach other real hearts. And I'm a real heart. And I try one approach. I saw how I'm being set up. No big deal. I'm going to change the approach. That's all. That's all this is. Always a way. Infinite ways. And at the heart is all of it. So one of those ways, well, the an important way that I was going into today is to talk about my my story personally you know my my own life what i've what i've been through how this system has just torn me down and 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 absolutely broken me this system did that and i know it's done that to so many of you well all of you real hearts i know it has I'm going to speak a lot to that and and be open and completely vulnerable in that way. And you're going to see, of course, I'll get attacked, absolutely eaten alive. That's okay. I'm, I'm willing to take that, uh, take that abuse just, just to prove out and show all of you who who truly understand and and feel what I'm saying. I'm willing to take that abuse just to show you, to show you that this is not a fun place. This is not a fun place to be that we want to stay. That's what I'm saying. I can speak to that all day long, and that's really the most important thing anyways it really is if if i can't reach your heart in that way then then really there's no chance anyways so i'm going to do my utmost and just talk about myself and i these these fake accounts saying just show your face i'm showing you my heart who cares what my face looks like? I mean, really, what's that going to do? Here's my face. What, now you, you can insult my face? That's the the abusers, you know, that's all they want. They just want to insult my face next. Ha ha ha, he looks like this. And they can just toss all their insults. Which they will anyways, as I said. Everyone will see my face eventually anyways in the not too distant future. It's it's just going to happen. Uh it's it's not a big deal. I but at this time I'm showing you my whole heart. That's what I've always been doing and now I'm I've just been far more vulnerable with that. I'm completely vulnerable, open to attack completely. And I am, it, it's so obvious. I mean, I, I, it's just there, it's happening and they're not going to stop every single post relentlessly abusing, gaslighting, creating confusion, etc. I'm going to keep this one short, as I said, so I'm going to sign off on that note. Wanted to create a bit of understanding as to the change again in the approach. That's what, you know, that's what it's all about in this place. You have to change how you approach things really to survive being on the streets is all about doing that. You have to have a lot of street smarts. That's what that means. You can't be a dummy on the streets. You have to change your strategy often. Otherwise you just will not survive. It's a vicious place. It's, 
dangerous for sure. You have to be alert and a. You have to be constantly on the ball, if you will. Your eyes completely open. No time for not paying attention to every single detail that's going on all around you. That's that's the reality. And that should always be done anyways, not just on the street, but just everywhere. Just pay attention to the details. That's why the saying exists, the devil is in the details. Those are his tells, as I've already said. I'll talk to you all again tomorrow. Take care.